Hey, what up guys? It's Hexerdex Gameplay bringing you an all new Black Ops 2 custom map idea. Oh yeah? And yes, sorry I haven't posted a new video in the past week guys. I have been real sick, like I've had the flu, and it was disgusting. You guys don't want to hear what was going on in there. And I probably sound really sick right now, like my voice is completely like messed up. And it's all like snotty and stuff like that. So I'm just going to bring you a quick Black Ops 2 map because, you know, I, I felt bad for not bringing you guys anything. You guys put all your, like, your views towards my videos. You guys subscribe, and I haven't brought you anything, and it really sucks, and I'm sorry. So I really had this idea since Nuketown 2025 came out. Like, what if they did that to a Zombies map? And I, I really would love to see something like that. So maybe Kino Der Toten 2025. What? Hex, are you crazy? No, I'm not crazy. I'm genius. I'm genius, guys. So, yes, Kino Der Toten 2025. I was kind of thinking, you know, since uh, Kino takes place, what, in, like, the the 40s or something like that? Or the 50s? What? I, mean, I have no idea what it takes place in. But I was kind of thinking, what if they rebuilt it, you know, made it a, a futuristic cinema. A futuristic cinema with a, a bunch of new stuff. It's got the same layout, but it's got a lot of new things to it. New traps, new perks, new guns. Alrighty, so let's get down to the epic wonder weapon that I came up with. It is going to be a play on the Zeus Cannon and the uh, Thunder Gun, and I'm going to call the first one the Lightning Gun. And it's going to have a, an effect similar to the uh, the Wonder Waft, but it's going to look just like a, a Thunder Gun. But, you know, with a more uh, a futuristic look to it. Even though the Thunder Gun is already like a futuristic gun, I want it to be even more futuristic y. Futuristic y. Yes, so instead of it shooting like projectile air, I want it to shoot like multiple lightning bolts at zombies so it's got a, a large effect. Don't think of it like the Wonder Waff because it's got more lightning to it. It shoots lightning from all different angles and maybe it won't hit a zombie and maybe it will. You never know. Um, and it's upgraded version, I'm going to call the Thor Cannon. The Thor Cannon? You can't be serious. No, I am serious. Get over it, and I'm still sick. <laughs> um, yeah, so the Thor Cannon, it's gonna basically be a double Zeus Cannon. That's what I really wanted it to be. I want it to be a double Zeus Cannon that sprays lightning everywhere. I want, like, every inch of Kino Der Toten 2025 to have lightning across it. It's going to be an epic wonder weapon. It's going to be pretty sick. And I hope you guys might uh, think about it and say, hey, you know what? That's pretty awesome, actually. Um, the perk that I come up with, and it's pretty awesome, guys. You're going to love it. You're going to love it. I'm going to call it the Cocktail Clones. And what this does is once you buy it for about uh, 8000 yeah, um, 8000 is uh, a good price. What it allows the player to do is it gives the player two clones that they can command and control. Uh, you can buy these clones guns, perks, and stuff like that. And uh, they only last as long as you can keep them up. So make sure to buy them like Juggernaut and stuff like that. So what you can do is you can place them on the map and uh, you can place them anywhere you want. So you can have them in front of you, guarding you while you go do something. But I really think this perk is very handy, and you guys might actually like it. It's a pretty cool perk, and they should put it in the damn game. Put it in the game, Treyarch, damn it. I posted like 30 maps. Why haven't you done anything about this, damn it? I'm still sick. Um, For the equipment, I wanted to get rid of the teleporters. Screw the teleporters, guys. Get rid of those things. Why not, since this is a futuristic, why can't you buy a teleporter watch? What? Hex, are you serious? Yes, a teleporter watch. So what it does is that... You get one teleport per, maybe per round, just like the actual teleporter so it can recharge. And what you do is that it allows you to pick certain areas in the map. It's going to show a mini map, and you can teleport to whatever area you want. Say right next to your teammates, or uh, to secret areas. Who knows, you know what I'm saying? Who knows? Um, but that is basically it, guys. I haven't come up with any traps, and I don't think this is a perfect map for boss, guys. So no boss for this map. Um, remember to like these videos, guys. It really helps out, and I'm sorry I haven't posted a lot of good ideas in the past couple days or maybe a week, because you know me, I've been sick, and it sucks to post videos when you're sick, and it really blows, and I'm sorry, but uh, hopefully you guys subscribe to Hex Zombies, that would really help me out a lot, and uh, remember to keep subscribing, guys, oh my god, for these epic zombie maps, hopefully they put my maps in, uh, in one of the Black Ops 2 maps, it would be so sick, guys. 
Uh, as always, my name is Hex, and you're watching Hex Gameplay. Peace out. And remember, guys, leave your awesome ideas in the comments below. I'd love to read them and talk to you about them. And if you want to come up with, like, Shangri-La 2025, or Ascension 2025, or Call of the Dead 2025, or Five 2025, or even Darice 2025, guys. Alright, peace out.